Check this out. This is Chuck D bringing the noise, and this is the blues for you. All right, let's go. The blues mean meaning to me is the sensibilities and sentiment, the, the attitude, the spirituality, the legacy, the history of a people, and stories that that could be sang or said or played. You know, even up to this point in 2012, 2013, um, if you follow people's music, especially black folks' music, you get our history by default. You you get our reflections. It's always been um, the best uh, surveyor of news that there's ever could been in, in our music and our spirit um, and our, our projection of self. So it could be visually, seeing a young cat spit something there on YouTube, it's coming from the inner self, the inner soul. Um, a lot of times in the past they say, well, you know, you can't believe, be a blues artist if you, you ain't really walk the walk, if you ain't really paid the price. But today you have a lot of young people who feel that emotionally that they've paid the price just by not knowing the surroundings as well as they should or the surroundings have never really been taught to them how to survive, especially young uh, people of color, especially young black kids. It's like they're still, you know, they're still emitting the blues. The, the blues don't have to be played or sang. It could be emitted just in attitude, a feeling, a curiosity, um, a confusion. The blues can also just be anger. The, the blues could be like like um, trying to, to break the shackles, um, trying to be free. So this quest for being free and being loud with it, you know, the blues can be loud. The blues could be like, you know, mm, just like it could be small gestures. It can be like an a eye roll, like, mm, you know, it could be all those things. So, um, And the blues ain't always a thing where, okay, people are... Uh, uh, a, uh, connect blues with misery or sadness. Blues can actually be like the fighting for expression. And um, trust me, you know, as far as the blues in a traditional sense, I spent time, you know, in, in Memphis and Mississippi and Alabama and, and down the southwest and I mean southeast and um, that's a different sense of reflection of, of how one was boxed and couldn't actually explore outside their realm. So they made the best of what they had. But also the blues can be, you know, things that happened in New York during the 70s and 80s. Rap music is actually really the blues where it first started and evolved out of New York where it was just, you know, hit hard by the cocaine and crack epidemic that took place and the survival and the freedom for happiness and joy and happiness happens to be a way that, that reflected the blues. And the same thing uh, with even somebody just expressing themselves through instrumentals on a electric dance, electronic dance music even to be the expression of the blues. And that's just sonically, but the expression and the arts and just the, just the way that we happen, happen to have our heart and our souls beat within us as the blues. So it's a rhythm. It's just a, it's something that can't be quantified. 